enough of that. Hey y'all, how y'all doing today? Um, yeah, I want to make sure that I am being consistent with this. Um, just as I was consistent somewhat with the pregnancy vlogs, this whole car vlogging thing or whatever, I want to be consistent with it too. So, I am back today. And I did not think that today of all days that I would do a video, but you know, it just kind of happens. So, I'm just off work, getting ready to go and pick up the chillin. But, um, but yeah, so today was like a really bad day. Like, I really wore my emotions on my sleeve. Yesterday was uh, kind of a, you know, messed up evening or, or whatever. But just like the title of this video says up there, um, it is another like relationship type video. So, um, I want to just talk, just, just candidly talk about, um, the dating world and getting yourself prepared and, um, you know, being, I guess what you would say, wife ready. Okay. Um, I know ultimately that's what I, I want to be. I want to be a wife. Um, I, there are some steps and things that I need to improve with myself, but I continue to try to make myself better each and every day. So, with that being said, I have a lot of little rules in my head and, you know, I choose to, to go by them because to me it's right. Now, until, you know, I meet someone and or, you know, find out otherwise, that's just what it is, you know, at this point. But, um, but basically, the, the first thing is that I know that, of course, you have to show someone that you can be whatever it is that you're saying that you want. I understand that. Um, and, and I do that. But I can't fully act like your wife if I'm not your wife. You know what I mean? Like It's like I'm kind of giving you the milk and the cow and all that kind of stuff in the same... And, and I'm giving you everything and you ain't gave me nothing. You know what I mean? So, um... I just, I try, I restrict myself. I, I let it be known. I let it be, I let it, you know, individuals should be able to see, you know, I come home or when you come to my house, I have a well-kept home. Um, I try my best to make sure that things are in order. Um, you know, I cook, I, you know, cook, I clean, I take care of my business with my children. You know, I'm involved with them, uh, extracurricular activities. And, you know, I, I carry myself as a woman. I make sure that I'm well-kept. Um, that I stay attractive, you know, I don't let myself go, you know, it, it, it's very rare that you might see me and I might just be looking like, woof, you know, something got to be going on, for real, and even if something is going on, I still try to, you know, at least got a nice cute little baseball cap on or something and I'm, I'm good, so, um, let me roll this window up because I don't know if you guys can hear that, but, but yeah, so I try my best to, to keep things going, keep things, you know, right and tight, um, but I, I continue to run into the same old crap with um, with me and time and time again. And, the, and what that is is that I continue to to show myself, improve myself, and then it's it just totally goes south. Or it or I guess it's just not meant to be. I guess that's what it's telling me too. But um, I'm just tired of it. You know what I mean? Like I was talking to this one person and. It was just on some real preliminary, let's see how things go. Um, you know, we are both at fragile points in our life type stuff. And, you know, little buddy just couldn't even be honest with itself. And that pissed me off, you know, because it's just like, if if you've gotten to the point where you've gotten to where, you, you know, you continue every other thing you talk about is I'm too grown to be doing this. You are. You're too grown to be doing certain things. Like, I'm too grown to be lying to a man about me dating other men. Or me lying to a man and saying, you know, it's this when it's really that. I, I don't have time for that. You know, and if you own that playing game thing, I let people know. I say, hey, if you are still playing, you know, Mac Daddy in, in the streets and doing this and doing that. If you are still doing these things, cool. You know, somebody just let me in. The police got people pulled over. <laughs> um, you know, if you if you if you still doing that, cool. You know, just don't, you don't have to bring me in. And I understand that some people just cannot be 100 at all. That's that, that's just not in their makeup. But damn, I just keep running into the same type of people. Shoot, I'm tired. So, um, you know, I, I got, I went to my word um, while I was at work. Bam. Like my little pink Bible. I know it was cute. So I went to my word. You know, I'm reading Proverbs 31, 10 through 30, 31. 
32 or something like that. Another, I'm, I'm reading that. I'm, you know, attempting to to get into my word and, and you know, stay faithful with that. And yeah, why these people don't know how to drive, so I'm gonna wait. Um, I got into that. I look, looked at a couple of YouTube videos. You know, it was this minister that is on on YouTube. Um, if I could find it again, I'll put his link at the bottom. And, you know, I've, I've, I've had a chance to, or I've tried to, you know, really get a chance to look into that. I guess I'm really not going to go to this gas station because I don't have um, cash. And like, Can y'all believe that? They give you a discount if you're paying in cash. Okay. <laughs> um, but, yeah, so... So yeah, I was I, I watched a few videos, you know, I got some in, intake, you know, I, I read over a few things, I highlighted some stuff, took some notes, you know, just to get my soul back right because the shit that I went through last night, y'all, you know, I mean, it, it just it was straight, pure. I don't want to be 100, so I'm gonna make it seem like it's your fault, type stuff, and that really put me in a in a funky mood because. You know, I really, I really like this guy. He's real cool. You know, we get along, we joke, we laugh, and we were friends first. And we've always had each other's back. And maybe that's what it is. You know, shouts out to my bestie again, Anisha. Um, you know, she made a, a, a great comment. I shouldn't throw away the friendship, you know, that we have. It's just that we tried something and it didn't work. So, you know, after all the yelling and screaming and all the, you know, bad things, um, I, I didn't get like that. But, but the things that he was saying to me, um, you know, I still let him know, you know, this morning I sent him a text and was like, hey, good morning. You know, so and that was just me smoothing things over, just saying, hey, you know, it I don't got nothing to say to you, but it ain't like I'm when I see you, I'm be like, mm, I'm not going to be doing all that, you know. So. So, yeah, that's that's where I am with this whole relationship thing and and the guy on YouTube was saying himself that you know you just have to you have you have to let your husband come to you you can't go out here and be looking for him and if you go looking for him he's gonna stress you out oh bing Belinda right now <laughs> you know like I've stressed myself out you know and 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 what i need to be doing is is focusing on myself and my children and what i will be doing for my extracurricular for the most part it, instead of you know trying to go see you know what's the hottest who the hottest is putting myself in my word and you know just allowing for it to come i guess because you know at this point i'm just i'm i'm giving myself gray right hair and i'm getting bags under my eyes because i'm not sleeping good and it's it's upsetting and I don't want to be upset. I don't want to be at work and because some stupid person does something that just totally doesn't make sense, but it shouldn't get you pissed off, pisses me off to the high heavens. I don't I don't want to be like that. So with that being said, if I am reaching somebody, you know, that has had this feeling and y'all done got past it and you're married now, or maybe you just got past it, leave me a message. Let me know, you know, help us to style out. And then if I've reached somebody and we on the same playing field, you know what I mean? Like, uh, th that's what this platform is for for me because, you know, it's somebody going through the same stuff I'm going through. It, or, like I said in my earlier vlog, my first one, I think it was, um, you know, ain't no sense in everybody going through the same thing and not talking about it. So that's why I'm just putting it out there. So if you are viewing this video and um, you know me personally, um, first of all, I deleted my Facebook page, but, um, and you know me don't think that you know me because I'm I'm vlogging you know you you know a little bit because I've said that I you know I've talked to someone and, and how I feel but um, just take it as I am a woman that is um, journaling via video without um, without putting anything too much out there like that so until next time y'all let's see what's on